Measuring grass on your farm on a weekly basis will increase profitability of your farm business by increasing grass quality and grass utilisation. Pasture Base Ireland has highlighted that there is huge variation in grass growth within farm, between farm and year. Research has shown that increasing grass utilisation by one tonne of grass dry matter per hectare will increase profitability by 180 euro per hectare. The objective of the Grass 10 campaign is to increase the level of grass utilised to 10 tonne of dry matter per hectare and achieving 10 grazings per paddock per year. Here is one farm achieving this target. My name is Percy Mills, my wife is Susan Mills and I have three children, Joshua, Keeva and Pippa. I'm currently dairy farming in Kildare near Kilcullen. I'm milking uh, 133 cows on a grass-based system. There's 52 hectares on the farm here. I supply the milk to Glambia. In 2016, this farm grew 16 tonnes of dry matter per hectare. Measure grass weekly on the farm to get the most milk solids from my cows. Like if I put the cows into the wrong paddock, it could hit me by 200 euros a, a day in the tank. That's money down the drain. You measure the grass, that's where the money is. I learned to measure grass with a discussion group down in Greenfields. It was a compulsory thing at the beginning, which I didn't really like the idea of, but um, now I can see the benefits of it, big time. Now I'm gonna take a grass measure here on this paddock. There's a, I'd say there's a thousand kilos of dry matter. I'm going to do as we could at four centimetres and um, that's roughly what the cows would be eating off the ground. Weigh the bag first to see that we're on zero. It's nice and dry, I'd say it's at 15% dry matter. Weigh the bag and the grass now and see. Okay, so there's a uh, 175 grams in the on the scale. So with the phone here, we get the calculator out, and uh, we'll see. First, we'll we'll convert the grams to kilograms. So that's um, 0.175, and then um, it's 15 percent dry matter. And um, so to do that, we multiply by 0.15, and then. Um, there's a 40,000 quadrants in a hectare, so we multiply that by 40,000. Multiply by 40. 1,050 kilos dry matter per hectare. I use Pasture Base on my mobile phone when I'm doing the walk as a tool on the farm to grow the grass, to show me where the grass is and to show me how to farm it well. It gives me um, a great plan for the week of where the cows are going to, um, to be grazed. If I want to take out pad paddocks for silage or, or good bales um, for, the, for the shoulders as well. I'd never top here. So I'm going to log into Pasture Base now. So I'm going to www.pbi.ie. Here's the web page. It tells you here the growth rates. Uh, I can also see other farms like Greenfields is the same sort of farm as my own. What growth rates they're getting compared to what I'm getting here. Uh, in the discussion groups, you can see what growth rates other farmers are getting and you can compare yourself. This is my um, homepage here and uh, this shows me uh, in green what I grew last year, in green, and this year I'm in the blue. So you can see this year already my growth is a lot better than it was last year. And uh, we'll have a look now at my wedge. If I scroll up a little bit there, you can see the growth rate here is at uh, 86. My farm demand is at 62. And the cover per cow is at 224. It's a bit high. I'd probably take out this cover here. It's at 1800 and I'd like to go in a 1400 cover for cows. So we'll uh, click on this one here, the mouse over. 
So I mark the grass here, cut silage later, and save. Now 18 has gone out of the picture. So we go scroll down here. It's it's a better picture growth and demand, and also the the cover per livestock unit is at 182, which is in the boundaries where I want it to be. So that's my decision made for this week. Nice even line, the demand line. And uh, each paddock is in line with it right down to residuals that was grazed there yesterday. So things look very happy on that page. Okay, also on this page here you can see uh, annual tonnage. And I have now got my last year's amount of grass that I've grown. And uh, uh, as you can see here, my average is across 16 tons. I can see there's one paddock here, 13. It didn't seem to grow as much grass. I'll have to investigate that paddock and maybe see what the reason was. I grow 16 tons of grass on this farm. Currently got the whole farm is now um, reseeded 100%. Um, the soil fertility on the farm would be very good with a mixture of um, cattle slurry and dung and also with a bag fertilizer. Soil fertility, you have to feed the, feed the grass to make it grow. I walk the farm every week. At this time of the year, I walk it nearly, nearly twice a week. That gives you great knowledge of what's going on on the farm. I'd recommend to learn how to measure grass. It's key to the future. You measure the grass, that's where the money is.